Take it. Take a bath. You're stinky. Spit to yourself, pinch. I agree. Shut it, Connie. I only like tennis ball in a platonic way. Guys, I have a plan. They're letting us use stuff in the pile of junk. We can use this generator to power the motor in the rock. Hey, hey! Are you even listening to me? I don't care what you say, I'm still trying. You're lying. You wouldn't do that. Your tiny, teeny, tiny little brain wouldn't allow such insanity. Wow! Woo! Now my chances of winning went up from 5% to 5.263%. What made you think I was using a calculator? TP, what in the spiritual world was that for? Okay. <laughs> TP, help me. Thank you. Arms might be useful right about now. Throw us up. Help us up. So, um, are they gonna pick us up, or what? Do 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 Done! Rocky, you haven't started? You don't know how to write, do you? Grr! <laughs> mix, 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 mix! La la! Cake's done! It smells dirty! Oh well, probably just me. Are you sure about that? But I didn't put in any dirt! Wait, a die doesn't even have- what? You're the only one who matters? Whoa! I'm the stupid one? What did I tell you? No ball, you never learn, do you? SP, next time build a staple structure. I'm spinning seven. Yeah, especially because there are only nine pieces. Sorry! Hold on a second, there's something that's unfair. My team has many more members than the other team, so if everyone goes once, we'll take much longer. Well, process of elimination. There's Espy, Leafy, Rocky, me, Teardrop, Tennis Ball, and Coiny. Farby's been chosen, so it's Ice Cube. The Ice Cube Recovery Center won't start until she's completely melted. Well, what are you waiting for? Melt, Fiery! You already said that! Move your Red, Rocky, like Red! this great try to cry not a drop i'll try <laughs> how's it going hey where's rocky would you look at that my very first tear i'll always remember this for the rest of my life what do you think that cloud looks like well i think it looks like a golf ball golf ball, golf ball. hey what is that speaker machine doing here well i will now my chances of winning went from 7.143% to 0.000% So how do I re-enter the game? I guess I got Go 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 That's easy for you to say you left the tiny loser chamber in episode 9! The TLC's lid will open in 3 minutes! What do you suggest we do to escape? Blacky, this is all your fault! I have a 6.666 repeating percent chance of joining the game! And if I rejoin, I will have a 16.666 repeating percent chance of winning Dream Island! So from this moment, I have a 1.111 repeating percent chance of winning Dream Island! I vote Ice Cube because she doesn't have dimples! <laughs> Now my chances of winning went from 1.111 repeating percent to 0.000 repeating percent. What do you hear? The king has speak! Leafy. And I realized all of the finalists weigh less than one tenth of an ounce. According to my imagination, 99.8% of all islands are destroyed within two hours of being sold. I'll help as well. Let's ask Leafy. She's on the other side of the gate. Leafy, I know you're upset, but that doesn't mean you have to call him names. I think I know what's going on. You bought Dream Island, didn't you? That's how you know everything. This is all your fault, isn't it? Fiery rejected you. You wanted revenge. Isn't that what happened? Admit that's what happened, Leafy. Admit already. I think it's time to see what's really going on inside this so-called Leafy. I didn't mean it literally. Well, it turns out that Leafy's not such a nice person after all. Leafy was the one who bought Dream Island so that none of us could have it. Any last words, Sleepy? Hurry up! We have to get back to the execution! Don't 
you want Dream Island? Yes, we do. Because if we let Leafy escape, she'll steal Dream Island. Yeah. Pen, which way do we go? Hey, Eraser, any more rules? Let's split into teams. Stop it, people. So how are we going to do this? But only days of flying. Uh, turn around. Spongy, gelatin, book, needle, and ice cube. You can all ride Puffball to Yoyo Land. Bring back lots of Yoyo berries. Yeah, listen to Pencil. Now go. As for the rest of us, we have to put together the other ingredients for the stew. Guys, you're all thinking too small. If we want a big bowl, we must build it ourselves. I've drawn where the base of the bowl should go. Hmm, Nickel, Yellow Face, Fiery, Dora, and Rocky, you build the bowl. Ruby, Fry, Smash, and Pencil, you get the ingredients. I'm team manager. This isn't an excuse. It's a very necessary and demanding job. Uh. Yellow Face, we don't have time for ads. You should be building our bowl. And you two should be going to Yoyo Land. Match, not nice. He was our teammate! Good, you're back! We're almost done! I think we're done with this too. <laughs> but I was supposed to get the most likes! I manage the team! Ruby! Pencil! Match! Why aren't you coming? You can't do that! Every team member must- shh, shh. Yellow face! Stop being poisoned! You've got work to do! Rocky! If you read my book of BFDI tips and tricks, you'd know never to eat the poison remains of a dead contestant. Uh? I'll bring Ruby back. People, stop talking. I don't want to hear any more prattle for Dream Island. T team No Name, we're going to my underground factory to build. Well, yeah, why would I not? It encourages inspiration, creation, and innovation. Everyone should have a factory. You should build one, Price. <laughs> That is, that is none of your business. All right then. So here's our plan. We <sighs> if you don't like this team, why don't you just get out? Send her to the incinerator, tennis ball. You want to go there too? Listen, Match, my factory, my rules. Okay, so I have this vat of dream sauce. The first step is to superheat it in the ovenotron. Now the dream sauce is hot enough. When you pour it on the floor, it should coagulate into Dream Island. My vat will pour Dream Island. Just watch. <laughs> Thank you. Hurry up. But I was supposed to get the most likes. I built Dream Island. What? Why do I keep getting so many dislikes? I am the leader of my team. But, but if I leave, the whole world will plunge into chaos. Just think about it. Thanks for the compliment. But my main goal is not to be funny. It's to keep order and peace so that our team will excel the victory. Uh, oh, goodbye, Match. Your elimination will be beneficial for our team. Ugh, they keep stealing our team members. This must stop. Oh, I know. Everyone on our team must promise to never switch to a bunch. If all of our team members cooperate, we should be safe. I also promise. Good job, Puffy. Do you promise, Rocky? Wow, this is going better than I expect. What? That's nonsense. You have to promise. You need to promise right now that you will never leave my team. It, uh, uh, no, stop this immediately. This is unacceptable. Team No Name, get on to Puffball ASAP. <laughs> no one can defeat the Puffball. Oh, no, Johnson. No, 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 no. Okay, roll call. Gelatin, fries, fiery, rocky, golf ball, tennis ball, and I, golf ball, am also here. So that's everyone. I believe we are ready to continue our mission to reach Yoyo Land. Step one, position yourself on top of golf ball. Leave them there. They are traitors! How can there be snow when the temperature is 42 degrees? Celsius, that is. Do not ever use Fahrenheit. There are no seeds. You see, living creatures do not grow seeds. Whoa! Shortcut or not, David Land is a very dangerous place. I would prefer you take a different route. So how do we get them back up here? It looks like we play second. Not bad. At least we are not up for elimination. Everybody, get onto Puffball again. Price, ride Puffball down to the HPRC to recover Rocky and make it snappy. We're falling more behind every second. Puffball, why'd you stop? We're so close. We have a 99.4% chance of winning. What are you doing? That's the most insane thing I've ever...
I don't know how to solve like anything. Yeah, so I'm glad we're finally going to be able to learn from other scientific endeavors. Well, I think it's a science museum because the sign says science museum. And we're here now. Let's go in. It is. There is not to find science treasure. Needy needle. We're going to enter the science museum of Yoyo City on our eternal quest to create innovation and creation. Why? Needle, why don't you just go slap a few strangers for me? Tell you what, they probably called you needy. <laughs> Behind your back. Come on, TB. I wonder what that was all about. Needle's been acting quite loopy lately. But look at this place. It's got treasure just waiting to be stolen. Yeah, see, aren't you glad you came here? Okay, let's see what's in this next room over. No, 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 we need to leave. Listen, I don't know why, but we have to go now. Oh, that's a good idea. But the tiny loser chamber is also inside the locker of losers, which adds another five inches of metal wall. Guys, let's head over to the LOL now. Okay, so the plan is to shoot this thingamadoodle into the tiny loser chamber to pull somebody out. Wait a month or two, and then repeat the process. Sound good? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? If anything, Snowball deserves to be in the locker of losers forever! Hold on, TB. I'm busy looking for Leafy. Just, I have to concentrate. Wait, there's Leafy right now. Based on my calculations, we need at least two mechanical mice in order to outsmart the other teams, which are lacking in mechanical minds. TV, Robot Flower, you've been selected by my formula for a successful team. Grassy, we're not here to do funny things. Hmm, if we want to win, then our team must have a better name than that. But I believe Eraser is right. I have deduced that yes, it is time to start the first contest. My plan this episode is to have Blocky and Robot Flower climb the trees to catch the baskets because they've got arms. TV will relay coordinates of baskets location, and 8-Ball and Basketball will weigh the baskets down once we've got a hold of them. Oh, you're alive? I thought you were just an overgrown section of the lawn that the gardener forgot to mow. I'm managing the team! Okay, so Tennis Ball's gone, but we're still on track to get the basket in minimal possible time. Hey, Blocky and Robot Flower, how is the climb going? Oh shoot, Robot Flower has betrayed us. We cannot afford to suffer a second death. People, try to cushion his fall! Oh, wow, Bressy, you were actually useful for once. Good job. Yes, that's correct. Oh, well, you see, my calculations tell you that, 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 huh. Well, I guess we'll just use the trebuchet tennis ball built before he died. Physical exertion builds character. Ah, stop it! Thanks for free. Oh, come on, really? Grassy? What? You can't replace me? I'm the team leader! TB, do something! Okay, guys, spin forward. Huh, you didn't obey me. People, you can't be serious. Uh, maybe you could at least jump up? <laughs> Turn yellow? Hmm. Hmm. Spin in circles really slowly. Teardrop team already finished. Guys, let's not waste time here. People, time is running out. <gasps> I got paper. Here are the markers. Uh, go down. Up, up. Right, left. We almost lost. This is bad. <gasps> Eight ball, you're not a completely useless moronic dumb robot. What? Oh, Eight ball. See you guys. How's the steering going? <laughs> you really think so? Well, hmm. <laughs> Any number times zero equals zero, right? Four's a number. Let's multiply him by zero. Okay, team better name. Is everything lined up? Go! <laughs> yeah, makes sense. Because four times zero is zero. Yeah. TV, calculate! There's your answer! Better namers, get to my rocket! We'll go to the moon! There's no way we'll see the twinkle from there! You said you'd stop that! I'm so glad we arrived on the moon! That means the nearest sign of twinkle is 400,000 kilometers away! <laughs> Why do my plans never work? Robot Flower's right. TV, calculate the odds. See? Um, are they gonna pick us up or what? She was the only Earthling out of both of our teams. Ready to go? All right, 
Robot Flower, you're going to translate our inputs into signals that the ship can send to remote. We have to trust you, okay? Don't break the signal. All right, let's go! What? Who do you think you... Uh, you're right, I'm on it. Wait, what? Robot Flower, you promise not to break the signal! TV, promise not to fudge the results. Don't, Don't worry, basketball. basketball. I, will I will try my hardest, hardest to remain on the team, team too. Hey, shush, she's talking to me. Whatever. It'll, It'll be, be so, so much easier when you're gone. Two. Wow! What was the first thing you took from the science museum? That's right, so you must be the real tennis ball. But wait, Pin, Coiny, Nickel, and Fries also know about that. So you could be any of those people too. There's no need. I know I'm me. Basketball, who is the team leader? Yup, checks out. Since I know you're real, I'll let you interview half the other guys. Wow, you're a great singer. Prove that you're grassy. But how? What makes you think we can't read X's mind? Yup, I built an MMR, Mutual Mind Reader. If you point it at someone, it tells you exactly what they're thinking. Look, but oh. there's a catch. It's mutual, so they get to read one of your thoughts too. Okay, so let's get Tennis Ball to read X's mind so we can determine what and where the treasure is. Now remember, TB, X can read your mind. X is our host, so don't disrespect him. Don't think X is dumb. Don't think X is whiny. That's kind of hard X when you're saying Don't that think out X is loud. Horrible. Don't think X is stupid. Great work, TB. Absolutely not basketball. You're not high enough on the managerial hierarchy to be trusted. Dig over there. Okay, according to my TPS, we are directly above the coordinates. Robot flower. You must get along with broken machines. Go get my broken rocket. Everyone get in. Shut up, Blocky, and start rotating the satellite dish. Ha ha, Emeralds, here we come. Noise means we've hit the emerald. Good plan. Everybody, well jump. <laughs> hey, four, here's your emerald. Oh, well, golf ball thinks it's a big deal. Four, want to hear a joke? Three, there we go, got it back. What? It happened again? Unbelievable. <laughs> hmm. Is it me, or is it getting warm around here? I mean, no, seriously, I mean, I think... the temperature is 10 standard deviations above normal. And all the grass around me just died. Wait, I know the explanation. A lynx lava chamber must be chasing an underground team. They nearly broke the surface, which brought the lava close enough to the grass to heat it to death. But this team clearly values avoiding me more than their own safety. There's more. If I want this pathetic team to stay underground, lose, and be put up for elimination, I must prevent them from ever breaking the surface again. Aha! The grass over there is starting to die. Not so fast, you dimwits. Where's next? Where's next? You wanna make your next move there, you say? Well, what if I say no? Oh, so this is Golf Ball's idea of fun. Yep. Ha ha! Ha ha! Stop you there! Yes, and each of these 2,763 dead patches of grass is a beauty! Just look at them all! Wait, maybe they're trying to communicate with me. They raise a very convincing argument. But it's not enough. I'll continue. Ha! Ah, there's an intruder sneaking into my underground factory. I need to go investigate. Who could these barbaric trespassers be?
bubble. Uh, uh, this book is over a billion years old, and it's written by Golf Ball, who's a total bozo brain bossy bot. What does she know? She was eliminated eighth. <laughs>